The political battles between KCCA's Lord Mayor and the Executive Director just don't seem to end. The latest feud among the officials is this document that the Lord Mayor presented to journalists yesterday as the Auditor General's report. If you looked at it, oh my God, there is no difference between the current accounting officer and her predecessors. The document highlights the alleged misuse of millions of taxpayers' money by the executive director and her team. But the executive director says the leaked document is a management letter from the Auditor General that she and her team are ready to respond to. It is not an audit report. It is a management letter as required by the audit and accountability provisions that govern government institutions. This is really very unfortunate. As I said, sometimes we're in offices, we do not understand how government systems work, and therefore we get mismanagement of government information. The document's key highlights include the payment of over 20 million shillings to the executive director as overtime allowance. It also mentions the payment of huge allowances to drivers, which is in contravention to the public service standing orders. The accountabilities are available, and as usual, because some of us have been in these government institutions for many years, I have appeared before Auditor General many, 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 many times, and I know how that process works, I know what the submissions look like, and even right now we are compiling the submissions. The wrangles between the city hall leaders has dragged on for months and has, in the process, threatened to affect the delivery of services. Chris Sochamringa, NTV.